for a theater that uh, develops and produces almost exclusively new works. I'm acutely aware of how difficult it is to get a play produced professionally in America at this moment in time. And all the wonderful playwrights who are writing and really are like Sisyphus going up and we want to be able to champion their work as much as we can. Any type of play, any genre of play that you can imagine, that is what they do here. So there's comedy, drama, historical, bizarre, a couple of musicals thrown in to just keep you off balance. We do six plays a year. Two wonderful plays came up. And our artistic director, Suzanne, said, I can't let these go. So I said, well, how on earth are we going to fit them in? So we wound up doing eight plays because we were afraid that something would slip through our grasp that we could advocate for and champion. I love our audiences. I'm usually in the concession stand before the show, so I get to really interact with them. And they're so passionate about this theater and about the plays we do. And I mean, like you said before, this is a weird little theater, and uh, I think our audience kind of gets it. I'm like, watery-eyed thinking about them because I, you know, I, they're so loyal and so smart and so willing to go there for whatever it is, you know, I mean, most horrible things that are said and done on stage and, and they want more. I was in a slightly controversial play and there were some very uncomfortable people and we had people say, you know what, I wanted to leave after the first act but I stayed. And they stayed because they trust New Jersey Rep. Just about every single role that I've done here, and I don't know how many plays it's been, but uh, a number, I've been asked to do something that I didn't ever imagine myself doing. I was always this um, comic character actor, and they've given me some really remarkable, powerful roles here. And somebody stopped me once and they were like, oh, I couldn't even look at you. I couldn't even look at you. I can't look at you now. I couldn't even look at you because I had disturbed them so much, which thrills me to no end, you know, as an actor, just to have that kind of relationship with an audience member, you know. I know that my life would be much more easy if our theater did the wonderful, established classical plays that we love and how wonderful it would be for us to sink our teeth into those plays and see what we could do with it. But that's not our role. Our role is to take chances.